today is the class number 13 you have a bapi over here okay you have a bapi over here this bapi is bapi material save data this is to this is for the purpose of mm01 right if you want to perform mm01 manually instead of doing the manually you can use the program this uh, this particular bapi to perform this transaction like if you want to do programmatically this is the function module you have to use okay another you have the bdc you have seen how i have recorded the transaction mm01 and put into the program and automate the things now my question is will you go for the bdc or will you go for this bapi which let, let's suppose you are a developer you know this question is quite technical so what approach or let's suppose a base uh, a bapi is asking to you that which one do you want me to use what will be your suggestion can you write here in the chat box what you will suggest to them bdc or bapi siva is telling bdc nityanand is telling go for bapi falguni bapi sachin bapi very good so bapi is the correct answer bapi is the correct answer so if you remember we were discussing about the drawback of bapi you know and some people were telling also that bdc is going to be obsolete right so use of bdc may be obsolete right but the backward compatibility will be always there and you know so the thing is that bapi is the most preferred way number one way bapi you know because in bapi there is no involvement of a screen okay so this is always evergreen this is always evergreen bapi material save data from performance point of view also it is evergreen right because there is no involvement of a screen so this is again very good from the performance point of view also so this is going to be your preferred way and this is not going to be your you know this is not your preferred way okay green means preferred yellow means not preferred you have warning before using the you know bdc fine so this is what and you have given the correct answer let's go to the system quickly and i will run this and i will show you that how easy to debug the bapi so here this program i will give you the background of this program okay so or 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 any one of you can you come on the hot seat and let me know would you like to read this program and tell me what this program is doing okay or just open your chat box i will be asking and you have to give the answer okay just keep open uh aside the chat box and just i'm asking and you know you have to give the answer so what are these these are declaration part right this is this is the declaration part so this is the declaration part here we have created the structure right having the three to five five fields this is structure is for five fields here one string is there this is another structure having a single field called a string right okay and here we are defining the internal table i t underscore tab i t underscore data i t underscore tab is type table of this one and i t underscore data is type table of ty data again this so two internal table is defined over here okay then gt file table type file table gwf file table type file table two one internal table one work area this is the file table one what one structure will be there right 
if you can double click you will be able to see that what's the component in this so this is table type basically okay the field you can see that this is the field name file name cat 1024 so what will become then this will become your internal table because this is your table type right and this is this will become your work area because this is your what a structure if you double click you can see that it's the structure so you got so these are the data declaration part okay here at selection a screen on value request for this event is used for what purpose for f4 purpose so whenever you will press the f4 that means the search help. f4 is nothing but search help right whenever you will press f4 this particular you know uh, event will be triggered and inside that event till here that code will be going to execute it right so let me activate this activate this and i'll put the breakpoint over here and i will show you put the breakpoint over here and press f8 so as soon as you will press f4 see that debugger is executed and this this is what this is the class and this is the method okay the method of this class we are calling for the purpose of selecting the file okay so press f6 and that pop-up will open over here i have already there one file prepared for fff <clears throat> okay so i have selected that file and you can see that the control has moved from there to here and now what it is doing it's a reading because in this gt file underscore table if you see one record is there and this is how the under the file name this value is coming so this value we have to put in some you know parameter right so this is what p underscore file is a one variable in which this value we are putting from the file name right so first they are reading the first index this is an internal table you can see that internal table and the first record is this one so they are reading the first record and putting into this work area right currently work area will be blank see here nothing is there when you will press f6 you can see i pressed f6 the value in work area is populated and now this value they are putting into where in p underscore file okay so p underscore file is currently blank again if you press f6 that value from work area will come into this particular variable okay and this variable they are passing it over here right for uploading purpose what we are uploading the text file they are uploading right what they are doing over here see it's 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 easy to understand why see here they have written gui upload here they have written file open dialog means dialog need to be open to upload the file right very simple to understand gui upload we also don't understand the code what they have written in inside this it means if we want to understand we have to go inside that we don't have to worry what they have written the code inside this nothing to debug because this is the standard one we can ignore that okay okay yeah quick question so in this mm. call method uh, mm -hmm. there is a greater than and equal sign what mm. exactly that means here in yeah it, the meaning of this means this is the method of this particular class okay, okay. meaning of this means yeah actually there are two types of method one is a static method and another is instance method okay so in order to access the static method this symbol we use okay this symbol and when you have to access the instance method this particular symbol we use single hyphen okay but but you don't have to get confused with this uh, you know a static method or 
instance method ultimately they are method only technically they are having the differences but ultimately both type of method will be having the exporting parameter changing parameter and importing parameter so here no importing parameter so that is fine because in this method there will be not be but you can have the importing parameter you can have the returning parameter right so we don't have to confuse with those jargons simply we have to understand this is a method and this method is returning this uh, a value so when we are when we have executed this uh, value got populated and these we are using over here for the reading purpose and we are getting the data into this okay and once you got the data over here you know you can put the breakpoint over here and now i'll press f8 when i will press f8 or f6 where it will go the control on the selection screen right the control will go to the selection screen because i had pressed on the f4 and now the value this value is populated now you can press f8 right and this time what will happen that you know when you pressed f8 control has come over here and already have put the breakpoint here after a start of selection it will directly move to where a start of selection it will directly move to the start of selection you can see that because this is the event only for f4 36 number line at selection screen or value request for this will not come you know during effect this is only for f4 see the name of the event at selection screen on value request for right it's telling on value request for means search help fine so that time only it will be 